Benjamin Mendy. He's been charged with four counts of rape. Michael Adebolajo and Michael Adebowale, they ran over Fusilier Lee Rigby, armed with knives and a meat cleaver. Adebolajo tried to behead him. Adebowale hacked at his body. Fucking saying that Newcastle deserved Bruce. Half cast cunt. Staggering rise in abuse against black footballers. The referee has clearly brought things to a halt here. Racist slurs, boos, and even monkey chants had been increasing in stadiums. Online abuse went up 48% in just half a season. Of abuse faced by Marcus Rashford, Bukayo Saka, and Jaden Sancho after the Euros finals. Social media companies promised to do more. I want to investigate if anything has actually changed. What are the platform's criteria for judging a post to be racist? And I want to find out who the people spouting online hate are and why they're doing it. 40-year-old Andrew Young, who had Asperger's syndrome, a form of autism. He died, and this was the man who killed him. 20-year-old Lewis Gill pleaded guilty to manslaughter, but his sentence of just four years in jail has now caused outrage. His killer, who was already serving a suspended sentence for robbery, could be free to walk the streets again within a couple of years. 36-year-old Darren Pencil, who just minutes later would be involved in a deadly confrontation, turned violent. In images shown to the jury but too graphic to be released publicly, the victim is seen being stabbed 18 times in just 25 seconds. Aaron Pencil admits possessing a knife but has pleaded not guilty to murdering Lee Pomeroy. He was caught and sentenced to ten and a half years in prison. The other acid attacker was never found.